Hey guys, it is Tyler here back once again with another Assassin's Creed video. Here, as you see probably in the title, we're talking about is speculation gone too far in this Assassin's Creed Empire discussion where I'm titling it Assassin's Creed Empire. That speculated game. I, ladies and gentlemen, the irony is not lost on me here, but <laughs> I'm just... I'm, <laughs> there's been so much speculation, so much discussion over a singular legit article leak back in January of 2016 and I'm exhausted I've said this before I was exhausted back in September last year I took a bloody month off this channel I was so exhausted from the bullshit speculation and I'm not going anywhere but I'm so over every little thing that's either fake or that there's a new leak coming out each and every day uh, listings that have just happened over the past week where ridiculous like online game stores have put up listings for Assassin's Creed Empire all that tells us is the game's coming out at the end of the year if it's true which it's probably not and they've denied it saying it's just speculation themselves anyway which they could be covering their tracks it could be legit but that doesn't tell me anything it was probably going to come at the end of the year anyway I don't care whether it comes out this year I just don't understand how we're still talking about every single day I'm getting a dozen tweets like, look at this fake leaked image, look at this thing, look at this and that and the other and we've got to sit down and prove it's fake and I just, I'm ex I don't understand. This is ridiculous at this point that we're getting excited over nothing. I don't care about Assassin's Creed Empire unless Ubisoft confirms it. I don't care how they confirm it, with an announcement article, with a tweet, with a demo, with a trailer, with whatever. And I don't care whether it comes out in 2017. I don't care whether Assassin's Creed Empire comes out this year, in two years, or in ten years. As long as Assassin's Creed Empire is a good, well-made game. In 2017, there's no excuse. No excuse for releasing a game that's not ready to come out, i.e. Assassin's Creed Unity, and by the looks of it, I'm not sure myself yet, Mass Effect Andromeda, from what I'm hearing. That's the case, which is unfortunate. So we're sitting here speculating, getting hyped over every little thing, because, oh, it's going to come out this year, oh my god, and Amar said this, the head of content or whatever. It's, it's ridiculous. And I think this speculation's just gone too far in terms of every person tries to create their own fake leak and send it to people or everyone wetting their pants over Empire getting announced. Like, I used to get excited when new games got announced or leaked or whatever, like uh, Black Flag or 3 or Revelations. You know, my, my height of enjoyment of Assassin's Creed, you know, I'd see the leak and something. I'd be searching every day of news, 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 news. I want to know, I want to know. My heart would skip a beat. My stomach would drop and I get all butterflies I'm like oh my god oh my god it's a thing oh my god look at this I can't believe it that's so exciting and now I'm like I uh, zero my excitement level for Empire zero because I don't and it's not like in a, an Assassin's Creed thing if that makes sense it's a all games thing I do these days I've changed the way I get hyped for games which is I don't it might be because my life is busy so that when these... You know, I don't have time to get hyped. I'll play them when they're out. I'll give you an example. Let's say Assassin's Creed Unity. Super hyped. Couldn't believe it. So excited. Game comes out. Day one, Unity's dog shit. Uh, doesn't work. Ridiculous. And I'm disappointed. And the best part about that game to me is the build-up to it, not the actual game itself, which is so crazy. Let's look at Horizon Zero Dawn. Or Mass Effect Andromeda, for example. It doesn't matter whether they're good or bad or whatever when they come out, but they're games that I didn't really look into. Even though I'm a big Mass Effect fan, I'm I didn't watch any trailers. Avoided everything because I just didn't want to know. I don't want to know everything about the games before they come out. I don't want to sit around wasting my life getting hyped for something when eventually it's just going to come out anyway. The best part about the game is when it's out. I'll play it when it's out. Horizon Zero Dawn. I'd seen a trailer or two. Looked cool didn't really pay much attention all of a sudden it's the first of march and it's out oh cool i'll play it and it's a masterpiece that was an excellent game to play i don't need to think and look every day 
about these ridiculous empire things. Obviously on this channel, I'm going to keep you guys updated on news. That's what I do. That's what I'm here for. But when it comes to something that's not legit, not official, that every other day is a leaked poster, a leaked pause menu, a leaked screenshot, a leaked this, a leaked that, and the other that's not corroborated, that's not legit, I don't know what to tell you. And I get exhausted seeing it. And I can only imagine you guys are with me being exhausted of this bullshit. You just want to know when it's going to come out. I don't care when it comes out. I don't know when it's going to be announced, guys. I don't. It may not be announced for another six months because it may not be coming out until next year. I don't know for sure. I'm going to tell you this. Empire's real and it's going to come out at some point. I can't tell you whether it's going to be revealed in March, April or May like James seems to think. Statistically speaking, based on the past events, he's probably in the ballpark of what's most accurately going to happen. In the next three months there'll be an announcement. But I don't know. Maybe. Maybe we'll get to E3 and they'll reveal it there. Fine with me, I don't care. Maybe they won't reveal it at all. Maybe it's like, it's not coming out this year, we'll reveal it later. Cool. I don't know, guys, what to tell you. I don't know when it's going to come out. And unless it's an official announcement, I don't care. I'm done with this speculation. I'm going to keep doing these videos where I discuss about this game we know that will come out but I'm not going to sit here and speculate with you about when it's going to come out what release date could happen when I want it to come out I just want the game to be good I don't care when it comes out I don't care about when the announcements are I'm going to talk to you about the game I want to see I'm going to talk to you about the game I want to play and I'm only going to be excited for the game when it is in my hands and I'm going to play it because I want the game to be good that's my thoughts on it. I don't know how you guys feel. Surely you guys are exhausted too. Maybe you're not. But for me, I'm I'm all set. So, I'm just exhausted from all the speculation. I'm exhausted talking every other week about something that's not true. The game's coming out, guys. Don't know when, and I don't want to be announced, and it doesn't matter. The only thing that matters is that when the game comes out, it works well, it's fun to play, and it's good. And that's what I will keep talking about on this channel is what we want from the game, what could be in the game, not bullshit. It's just me. Anyway, that's it for me today uh, on this weekly Assassin's Creed topic video thing, whatever's going on. Seems to be a thing, apparently. Uh, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Like this video, dislike this video, whatever you feel you need to do, that's fine by me. And... Just subscribe anyway, even if you fucking hate me. Just because, let's keep hating on him. Why not? I don't know. Don't do that. <laughs> that was a stupid thing to say. Anyway, whatever. Uh, thanks again for watching, guys. Really appreciate it. And I will see you very soon for something. Something else. I'll be around, probably, unless I die. Hopefully not. We'll see. This is the weirdest outro of all time. I'm just, just, I'm not even going to do a real outro. I'm not going to, like, have an ending. I'm just going to cut it.